You think we're going to beat all these games? Nope. Backlog Boys. No, probably not. We remembered. We're hearing Hick Goopoo. And we didn't even have to look it up. We just... We looked, looked up. We looked Austin up. Austin was like, hey, look up. Then we looked up, and then he was like, oh, we gotta grab that thing. Yeah, I remembered the molten rock. Yeah, we gotta... We gotta grab this... Take it And here. warp it up to our new, uh, thing. So, <laughs> Minda's gonna grab it with her little... You can go... Finger fanger. <laughs> yep. Yep. Grab it. Just excuse me, guys. I'm gonna borrow this for a second. Can I just uh, take this real quick? Yeah, you're not using this, right? I still don't understand that mountain up there. Looks like a... Oh, no, it's creepy. It's like a nearby moon. I don't yeah. like it. It looks like a planet. Yeah. The shape of it and the spacing of it just weird. It is very planetoid. You ever look at the... Well, okay, maybe this just happened yesterday because I got... Like, every time I get a new prescription, mm -hmm. like, when I look at the moon, I'm just like, shit. That's an extraterrestrial body. Just chilling out there. I know what you're saying. Yeah. Why do you, you get like a, this existential feeling? Yeah. Why do you think about that when you get a prescription? Because all of a sudden it looks super sharp and you can like see the. Oh, like a super like clear an edge. optical prescription. Yeah. I thought you meant like drugs. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I go to CVS. And I was like, what kind of drugs yeah. are you taking? <laughs> I get really high and I look at the moon. <laughs> that is a terrestrial body out there, dude. Um. Sha. Extra. Dude, this yeah. cream though. Yeah. Bracky is literally performing cookie lingus. <laughs> Which is the name of one of the episodes. On the Oreo yeah, snack yeah. pack. Well, yeah. aptly so. Yep, he's sticking his tongue right into the creamy part of the Dunkaroo. There's a reason the ladies like my tongue. Oh, God. Yeah. Oh, no. okay, we'll just uh, we'll just post Bracky's phone number in, uh, in the description of this video so the ladies can send him text messages and uh, booby pics. You can be in my Jiminy Whispers. Oh, my God. <laughs> Let's not talk about Jim. <laughs> I think I would think that if anyone here wanted to talk about Jim the least, it would be you. I don't care. I think it's funny how uncomfortable you get. It, not so much uncomfortable as just like embarrassed. At least that's over for you. <laughs> hey man. But hey, we've all been there. We all make silly mistakes in one capacity or another. Mine was just a large mistake. Yeah, yeah. having to do with women. <laughs> hey, it could have been worse, man. Uh, Could have been worse. You're still you. And I still poo. That's still right. Still poo. That's my motto. Chocolate still cookie. you, still poo. Yeah. I mean, do you need anything else? You gotta find, hey, like, the, uh... There's a bugger. There's a bugger. You Keep gotta playing. find the, like, leader guy, the right? Queen. Yeah. Is she pretty hot? I don't remember. I don't think so. I don't think now's the time. I think she might be a little, uh... Distraught. Excuse me. Uh, no, we gotta get the prince. Do yeah. We, do we have to go Not talk yet, to him? Though. We have to. We have to Is figure out that else? he's missing. Like, we have to trigger that he's. M do you have to just talk Maybe to all these guys RPG wait. style? I think we just need to leave. Well, we saw we saw him in the. In the oh, there we go. Yep. Mate. There she be. Um, yeah, she's pretty tasty. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah, dude, you know that tune. Mm. Yeah. All you water. ocarina players out there just got wet. Because because water. Because that's the serenade of water. You grossies. I wasn't talking about that. That's one of the most fulfilling moments. I wasn't ocarina talking time. about genital moisture. Jesus Christ. What what's one of the best moments? When you fill the lake back up. At the end of the temple. Yeah, and then you shoot the sun. Oh shit! And she get got the executed by Zant. Wow. Yeah. Straight up murdered. Wow. Executed by who? Zant. Zant. Oh, Zant's that dude. Yeah. yeah. The bad guy. Oh, Jesus, you touched me. Sometimes I forget did. that people in Zelda games straight up die sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This really? game is so dark. Whoa, dude. Whoa. Rated T for teens. Yeah. <laughs> Look out, moms. This game is <laughs> dude, ultra she, violent. She looks Whoa. like one of those shitty holograms you would get at the Scholastica book fair that would be like on the cover of a book or something. Oh, my God. Yeah, and it's like red, green, and gold. Yeah, exactly. You're like, wow, it's way down here. And you just there. go like this, you move it from side to side, and it looks like it's moving. Mm -hmm. It's like, oh, this is the coolest shit. I gotta get this one. And then you never read the book ever. Yeah, yeah let us know in the comments if you remember holograms and when they were cool in the 90s. Damn straight. I did the, uh, the, you know, the, the seeing, the seeing, the double eye ones, the seeing eye ones? 
Where you have to cross your eyes? I have like the, that's like my weird hidden talent is I can cross my eyes perfectly to do that instantly. I can do oh. it pretty quick, like yeah. Which is, I don't. There's something where I can like move one of my eyes by itself sh- for some reason. Maybe it's because I'm. Weird. Yeah, it's weird because they tell you to like Weirdo. they tell you to like touch your nose to the yeah. paper and wait like a certain number of seconds and then like slowly pull it away from your face. And I could never ever do that. No. I remember they, those used to be in, like, the newspaper. I don't know what that means. Until they probably figured out that that was bad for your eyes. Yeah. Um, and people would be like, oh, look at this. This is neat. You know, and I'd, like, put my put my nose up there, and I'd pull my face away slowly yeah, and sniffer. do it perfectly. And I would never see it. And they're like, oh, maybe, you know, someday you'll be able to. And I'd just be like, <laughs> no! And then I realized that if I just cross my eyes a certain way, I could just see it right away. Yeah, I don't know what it is. One of my eyes, I can trigger it. To just, like, go slightly off-center. And then it, like, works perfectly. I, it's huh. dumb. It's strange. It's not dumb. It's, I'm s- it's beautiful. Down we go. It's not, it's not your fault. Oh! Now, now, now that is, a, di- that is a jump that I would do. Whoa, swim, puppy, swim! Oh, man, you're getting Whoa. washed away. Did you, you see howling? Yeah, oh, some homeward bound shit right there. Jesus. That's what we need is homeward bound. Isn't there like a like a like a like a really bad like third movie? There's this. Well, there's the second. I don't know about third. Probably the second one is pretty bad. When they're but, in San Francisco. Yeah. I can't believe I remember. I was thinking there was like a third one that was horrible. I bet there oh, is. Aren't you awake yet? Look, yeah. We got all washed up. Silly Look lazy at her dog. Just floating yeah. from side to side. The gray fox jumped over the lazy brown. It's dog. It's definitely like the most sassy way you could float. Yeah, she's in a float. You know? She's got a lot of sassitude. Yeah. She got some sass and then hips. Let's go see the Ekans. When I row. Snappy. Dude, are we about to get like one of the darkest cutscenes in the game right here? When's that? Is oh. it? Is this the one? I know I it happens. So. I know it happens in this room, but I don't know if it's right now or not. I don't remember either. I think it might be later on. Talk to the snakey wakey. Do you remember? This is the last spirit. So. Do you remember where you were? And or how old you were when you found out that Ekans was Snake backwards? I was probably older than I should have been. <laughs> yeah, I feel like I was too, dude. Or that Muck was come backwards. Uh, we figured that out pretty quick. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> because Curb. we spoke in a backwards language from like middle school to Excuse high school. Me? Yeah, I've totally told you about this before. I'm sure you have. So we had we had a mixture of made up words and backwards words that were used to disguise what we were actually talking about, mm-hmm. so that if we needed to talk about something inappropriate uh, or something that we didn't want a certain person to he- to hear or understand, that we had a way to to mask it. Mm-hmm. So we had made up words that stood for inappropriate things. And then we had other keywords that we would just flip backwards and pronounce backwards so that people wouldn't know what we were saying. And it took our school, like, six years or so to figure it out. Wow. And there was a short period of, like, where they they were like, yeah, this is really cool. Like, with so much... So much school spirit and everybody is cool. Yeah. And they got their own thing. And And they realized they they were saying bad things. And then they, like, embraced it. Because, uh, and then it got to the point where it was so accepted that, uh, part of, like, part of, like, our class was responsible for making signs for things, like, to advertise events around the school. It would be and so they started using backwards words on it. <laughs> um, and it was at that point, it was at that point that the teachers finally realized that it was backwards words and not made up words. Wow. Like they thought all the words were made up just because they were weird sounding. Yeah. And so then they started listening for it and then they realized what some of the backwards words were. And then there was another short period where they like cut down on it and they're like, this isn't allowed anymore. Oh, that's not allowed. Uh, and then it and then it just went back to normal and they forgot about it. But it was it was kind of funny how it was like it was like a thing. Oh, shit. Don't no, there's no, only there's one guy over there. Don't kill these two Bobby oh, McFerrins. It doesn't, like, once you walk on it, it doesn't play. You can't on. leave just one Bobby McFerrin alone, and they'll come, they'll come back. Kill that guy. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, we had some, we had some strange, uh, Yeah, that's pretty, uh, we had some ridiculous sh- strange. Sounding. It was, it was ridiculously we complex. You gotta get the other one! I know, I thought he was right next to him. It was, it was crazy complex. There were, like, there were, like, rules, and, 
Like, uh, it sounds ridiculous. It was like its own little dialect. This is a tough one. You got to kind of goad one of them over to goad. Yeah, that's come on, come on, buddy. It's very similar to coax, but uh, goad Im implies like a poking or prodding. I love, I love goda. It's my favorite cheese. Whereas coaxing is more of like a pull. Oh, come on, goad is more of like a push. There you go. Come on. There you go. Good boy. Hey, you know how you get uh, Charizard and Venusaur on a crowded subway train? How's that? Mm -hmm. You poke them on. Tomorrow on Backlog, boys. <laughs> <laughs> End it. End it, Bracky. Oh, boy. We're out of here. Later, guys.